Royal Wedding of the Year. See photos from Crown Prince Hussein and Princess Rajwa of Jordan's nuptials. Royal wedding bells were ringing in Jordan. Crown Prince Hussein, heir to the throne, married Princess Radwa in Amman on Thursday. The couple tied the knot after a nine-month engagement in an Islamic marriage ceremony at Zaran Palace. A little peek inside the regal festivities. Here comes the bride. Jordan's Prince Hashim bin Abdullah walking with Rachwa al Sahid at the Zaran Palace in Amman on the day of her royal wedding ceremony to Crown Prince Hussein. After guests like Prince William and Kate Middleton found their seats and Crown Prince Hussein processed to the front of the gazebo, Princess Rajwa arrived with her groom's younger sibling. The bride entered the wedding on the arm of her new brother-in-law, Prince Hashim. Best backup. In a sweet moment, Princess Iman and Princess Salma followed Rajwa as she made her way in, fixing the sweeping train of her early sap couture dress and long veil to create perfect placement. Iman, 26, perhaps had a little practice with the task as she recently celebrated her own royal wedding in March. Bride and groom, Crown Prince Hussein greeted his bride with a huge smile as he entered the venue. The look of love, Princess Rajwa and Crown Prince Hussein shared a smile during the ceremony. It begins. The newly minted Princess Rajwa was all smiles as she sat beside Crown Prince Hussein at the front of the gazebo before 140 guests and the ceremony began. Regal Gazebo The Royal Hashemite Court released a wider shot of the stunning venue which brought the outdoors in with verdant florals. Just us. Crown Prince Hussein and Rajwa shared a tender moment as they exchanged rings. Just married, the couple was joyful when Dr. Ahmed Al Khalid, Iman of the Royal Hashemite Court, closed the service and sweetly kissed each other on the cheek. Some of the women performed a zagrata, a traditional ululation to show happiness at Jordanian and Arab celebrations. Arm in arm, the newlyweds made their way out of the gazebo. Special guest. With their, with their union, it was time to greet guests. The bride and groom briefly spoke with members of the congregation, which was comprised of their families, world royals, heads of states like Prince William and Princess Kate, prince and princesses. Crown Prince Hussein and Princess Rajwa shared a smile with the Prince and Princess of Wales, sharing warm hugs and kisses on the cheek. Guest list. Prince William and Princess Kate joined royals from around the world at the celebration. They reunited with Crown Prince Frederick and Crown Princess Mary of Denmark, Crown Princess Victoria and Prince Daniel of Sweden, Princess Hisako of Japan and Princess Suguko, Crown Prince Hakon of Norway, King Philip and Princess Elizabeth of Belgium and King William Alexander and Queen Maxima of the Netherlands, among others. Saba Salute. After connecting with the guests, the bride and groom walked below an arch of Sabas and hopped into their sheer rover for the ceremonial red motorcade procession to their reception. Riding in style, Jordan's crown prince Hussein and his wife, Saudi Rajwa Al Said wave as they leave the Zaran Palace in Arma. The custom car was previously used to transport the late Queen Elizabeth II when she visited Jordan in 1984. Princess Duty Jordan Prince Al Hussein bin Adullah II, his bride, and his bride Rajwa Al Said leave Zaran Palace during their wedding. Shortly after the ceremony, the royal Hashemite court announced that Rajwa will now be styled as a princess. 
a royal decree was issued to bestow the title of Her Royal Highness Princess Rajwa Al Hussein on Miss Rajwa Khalid Al Said on the occasion of her marriage to His Royal Highness Crown Prince Al Hussein of Jordan, the statement said. Day of celebration, Jordanian Crown Prince and his wife Princess Rajwa of Saudi Arabia waved to people lying in the street during a wedding parade after their royal wedding ceremony in Amman. People lined the streets for a glimpse of the royal couple as they traveled to their epic reception at Al Husseiniya Palace. Happily ever after, time to party, the bride and groom took in the cheering crowds during the journey to Al Husseiniya Palace to celebrate with, yes, 1,700 guests outfit change. For the evening banquet at Al Husseinia Palace, Princess Rajwa debuted a second bridal gown. She wore a cap sleeve ball gown with a sweetheart neckline and swelling embellishments while she kept on her delicate diamond tiara matching earrings from earlier in the day. She swept her hair into a chignon and added dramatic opera gloves. Modern Cinderella and a view from the back, Tiara Time. The Princess of Wales joined fellow royal guests in spotting tiaras for the evening portion, changing into a glittering pink gown and her favorite headpiece, Queen Mary's Lover Knot Tiara. Thank you for watching, stay tuned, and please don't forget to subscribe.